you're looking at an electric neon green blue Pariba tourmaline. It is fully certified, unheated. It is a special stone, extremely rare in this color. It is the natural blue and green coming together like this turquoisey color. Really, really, I mean, the, the fire, the luster, the dispersion is undeniable and electric. The stone weighs in at 4.3 carats. It comes with all the paperwork. This color is not common a lot of times you'll get green and it'll be a yellowish green but this is blue green and it's like a neon vibrancy to it i mean really a really attractive color good dispersion good fire i love the chevron design or that particular design cats put around it you got diamonds crisscrossing around that stone but that stone is just cut perfectly if you want pariba that is collectible to the max that is fully 100 percent natural unheated which is one in 10,000 paribas this hits the mark and I'll explain to you why pretty much you could heat this stone and oxidize out more of the green the same goes for the purple varieties of pariba you can heat them and oxide oxidize out the purple leaving only the blues and that's what 99 percent of everyone in the world did the same happened with tanzanite people would heat the pink tanzanites back in the day the yellow tanzanites and they would turn blue light blue or a form of blue and you would lose that pink but pink now sells pink tanzanite sells for over five 5,000 a carat in Tanzania, where blue has never surpassed 800 a carat. It's exactly the same when you're looking at rare gemstones like Pariba. Unheated natural Paribas are like miracles. I'm one of the craziest fanatics who held on to them throughout the years. I have sold hundreds and hundreds of kilos of Paribas, and I have held on to the ones that were beautiful in the natural form. Now, don't get me wrong, 99.999% of all Paribas in the world should be heated because they are not that attractive in the natural form. They've either got too much gray in them, the purple is off color, it's this or that. And when you heat them, you bring out that beautiful color within the crystal structure. But this is crystal. It's clean. It's vibrant. It's a color that no Pariba has. It's extremely rare. And these are going to be impossible to find in the future. So if you have any of these unheated Paribas, hold on to them. The price is just going to go up and up and up. Just like 100 years ago, nobody wanted pink diamond. Nobody wanted yellow diamond. They only wanted white diamond. Well, guess what? Pink diamond now sells for 20 times the price of white diamond because it's just rarer. Exactly the same situation here.